Well, when you think of art, what comes to mind? You may envision a painting, a sculpture, or even some architecture. Yeah, for one, Kate Fullman, he uses wood to create art. And the project he's most proud of is something that will stop you in your tracks. Ten on your side's Aisha Tolliver reports. Tucked away at the end of a dirt road in Capeville, Virginia, you'll find 83-year-old John Morris. Hey, come on in. <laughs> He's been chipping away at art projects since he was in his 20s. Some of my tools here. Construction tools and wood are at the root of his creations. But some of his best work is kept in his sister's garage. Chiseled in all the right places, the inspiration goes back to another artist, Clarence Bullock. After he called himself a wood doctor, I named myself the wood surgeon. But no surgeries were more time consuming than this one. When I came home, I found an old piece of wood. And I went in my little shop and I just started trying to call, call, and call. Beaming with pride, he called Bullock. He told me, man, man, you got something there. He said, uh, why don't you try for the real book in the record? Bullock's suggestion back in 2010 led to a masterpiece you have to see to believe. Each link of pine, all 9,600 of them, is meticulously sanded and shaped to match the one before it. This 1,600 foot wooden chain can be dragged out a quarter of a mile. Unbelievable first, but I knew he could do it because he's really good at art. It's not hard at all. It is, it's simple. It's simple. One, two, three. So easy, he may need a bigger box. You know what I'm thinking now? I'm 83 years old. Maybe adding on to that. I might take it to 2,000. Just make it longer, longer. And even if the world record isn't officially his, it don't make no difference. I got it here. I got proof right here. In Capeville, with photojournalist Kevin Rahm, I'm Aisha Tolliver, 10 on your side.